Did you know that a vitamin D deficiency is closely linked to iron deficiency? There's a bi-directional relationship that can significantly impact your fertility. When vitamin D is low, then it fails to suppress hepcidin, and this is a hormone that blocks iron absorption. And that means even if you eat enough iron, your body may not absorb it effectively. At the same time, and that's not a bummer, iron is required to activate vitamin D, so low iron status impairs the conversion of vitamin D into its usable form. And this creates a feedback loop where both of these nutrients remain insufficient. And this can happen despite adequate intake or sun exposure. And clinically, this connection shows up when you struggle with ovulation, short luteal phases, implantation issues, or immune balances common in PCAS or endometriosis. Many of you with heavy periods, gut inflammation, or yes, plant-based diets, you end up deficient in both iron and vitamin D without even realizing that they are functionally actually linked. Now, even a mild insulin resistance or poor bile flow can impair absorption and recycling of both. And the key is here to break the cycle. When you join my fertility circle and we go through the 12-week fertility program, then we address your gut health because it's so important, liver function, very important too, so we can support bile as well. And then we can supplement strategically. And we often begin with vitamin D3 plus K2, very important plus K2, because otherwise you might actually get a problem with calcium absorption to downregulate hepcidin and improve then iron uptake. And then you might be able to follow up with iron by glycinate once absorption pathways are open. But be careful, iron needs vitamin C for absorption and copper for utilization. Those things are very important, especially when your ferritin levels are low. So it's important that you address the underlying root causes all together and not just take out certain organs or certain nutrients. Your body doesn't work like this. Everything in your body works in harmony. So you got to address pretty much everything that could be affected.